There's a lot going on. I just met two sisters. One told me that she's excited about start making new friends and the other is excited to learn and she loves math. And so take a look behind me as school starts. As you just mentioned, kids are greeted by a bubble machine right here. And we've just seen the buses just rolling in with students that are just so happy to be back to school. There's even a sign over there that says it's back to school. Welcome back to school. And so new this year, uh, we're going to pan over to Deputy Granum right there. She is going to be the school resource officer for this elementary school and we're going to be talking to her sometime later today and that's a new thing within CPS is that deputies are going to be the school resource officers in elementary schools for middle and high school that's going to be the police officers they are going to be the SROs there on top of that security officers will be in schools as well but they will not be armed last May the school board voted to allow security officers to be armed but that's not happening because of the deputy and police presence in schools on top of that, the district launched a new report line. The school community can use it to report any concerns and you can do that anonymously. And this week, the speed cameras are up in school zones around CPS schools. If you speed when kids are coming to school or when they leave, you could get a citation. So take a look again at all the students and their parents that are excited to have to be back at school for the first day of school here at Trico Elementary School. And we're gonna have more coming up in 30 minutes. Live in Chesapeake, I'm Kamaria Bray, 10 on your side. Kamaria, thank you.